Oh, hello everyone. Today, uh, we're going to show you how to get into your house, hopefully, if you're locked out. Um, this is a new, I think it's a, was it a Gen Weld window? Um, so I'm going to see if they fix uh, the problem with these kind of locks here. Let's see that there. Um, those kind of locks, is, they have a, I guess it's like a defect really, which allows you to open the window with, uh, without, from the outside. Anyway, um, I'm going to show you how to get into your house if you're locked out. Also get through the screen as well, without using any tools. Okay, so um, with this kind of lock, so these kind of windows, um, they usually have a couple little uh, tabs, like metal tabs, like on this side here, that are like, they keep the screen in this little thing here. So all you really have to do is, um, I don't know if you can see this, yeah, right. all you have to do is just take your hand and it, it'll be towards the, this side, I believe, towards the, um, uh, well, whatever side that has these hooks on it, it'll be on the opposite side where it has the tab. So you just take your fingers and just pull that way. And then you can see how it popped out over there. And then you just kind of get a purchase if you can on a little piece. And well, maybe do the whole thing. And see if you can get it with a little bit there. Almost. Close. Okay. If I could just get a little purchase of something under here. Okay. It's very close. Let's do it. It's very close. Come on, little fella. I just want to get the screen off. So... <laughs> It's definitely out of there. If I could just okay. Most people have a pocket knife, <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and oh, got a coin in there. Hold on. A second. Okay, so just take your pocket knife, hold it to one side, just get it under there. All you need is something thin to get it under there, and you and you got it off. Okay, so pocket knife, or if you have a really thin finger. <laughs> okay. So, anyway, you can see the tabs on the screen there. So, most screens have these uh, tabs here, and so when you're on the inside, you can just pull them over and then open your window a little bit. So, the, the spring things are going to be on the opposite side of those tabs. And like I said, you just pull over, and then get a pocket knife or something, unless you get really skinny fingers, and just pop it out. Really easy. It won't, won't hurt your screen at all. Then, um... So I remember with this type of lock, and this is a new, a new window I replaced recently. So I'm gonna see if they fix this problem. So what we're gonna do is uh, basically, I'm gonna come over here. I'm gonna put both hands on the window and put pressure towards this side, and I'm gonna push the window up and down in its track while maintaining pressure to this side toward the lock side, and. Uh, I think you will see the lock being manipulated. I'm gonna move you guys over here so you can see this. Okay, so put you over here from this side, and you should see the lock being manipulated. Unless they fix the problem, and then that's cool. So keeping pressure on the window in and then towards that way, I'm gonna just move it up and down. Maybe they fix the problem. I don't know, it's like moving a little bit. But, uh. It's moving a little bit, but uh, I haven't gotten it yet, so maybe they did fix the problem. 
Come on, I just want to get my house. <laughs> well, hmm. Maybe they didn't fix it. Feels like it's really close to. <laughs> Come on, little thing. Well, hmm. So, maybe they did <laughs> fix this problem because, uh, I'm having a hard time, as you can tell, opening it this time. Let's see. <sighs> well, folks, maybe they fixed it, <laughs> which is cool. At any rate, I know uh, this does work on some windows. Um, apparently, this one has been fixed for the most part, even though it looks very similar. Actually, I wonder if I'm pushing the wrong way. Maybe I'll push this way. Well, I'm gonna have to say, folks, <laughs> I think they might have fixed it, <clears throat> which is good. Because I can't open it <laughs> that way. And I opened it before. So maybe it's with just with the smaller windows? I don't know. At any rate, <laughs> I did show you how to pop a screen off. So. Hmm. Go inside there. I'm gonna have to say that um, I think with their new, I don't say J, what, Gen Weld or whatever the heck those windows are called, very popular, but I think they might have fixed the problem here. So we'll put the screen back in there. Anyway, that's how I get the screen off. And just to show you that I wasn't 
making things up. I have another window over here. Um, same kind, just smaller. And uh, I will show you that uh, this definitely works. Um, just maybe they fix it with the newer windows. Anyway, so there's a smaller window here. And uh, I need to get my pocket knife again. Take the screen off. And let's see here. Oops. Oh, this one's. The screen is on there pretty good. Dad! What? You forgot to make some coffee with the TV and J in it. Oh, yeah, not yet. Okay, so... Like peanut butter and PBJ. Not yet, love. Okay. Okay. So lining it up, pulling it towards us, and then getting your screwdriver under there. Or screwdriver. Pocket knife under there. Most people still carry a pocket knife, right? Okay. So even with the smaller windows, you can get them out. Not too difficult. Okay, now. Got the frame. Got the screen out. Now I'll just show you this one. Like, it comes out pretty easy. The window's kind of dirty. Okay. Alright. As you can see, the Lot going up and down there. There you go. Okay, so you can see the lock was manipulated and easily opened with a smaller, perhaps older window. But uh, so, showing that, yeah, the technique works. So maybe with the newer, is it Genweld or whatever, Windows, very popular brand. They might have fixed it, which is cool. Anyway, that's how you can get into your house if you're locked up with these type of windows. Except maybe they fix it with the, and maybe it just works with the smaller ones. Because this is quite a bit smaller than the other window. At any rate, good luck out there, folks. Um, hope that helped if you're locked out. And uh, at least, at the very least, I showed you how to get those screens off very simply without breaking them or anything like that. Okay, bye. Have a great day.